Okay, hi, welcome. Welcome back to some more of the quarry. We are continuing on. We started and got into chapter one last time, so we're gonna be continuing on with that. I'm really enjoying this serious? so far though. That's called oh, it's breaking and to entering. Here. No, that's called retrieving our lawfully owned possessions. Why don't we just find Mr. Hackett and have him open it back up? Abby, come on, our stuff is like three feet away. Mm, sorry. No. As soon as we get back to the lodge, we'll find Mr. Hackett and have him help us get our bags. Fine. Yeah, so we chose to okay, well, do that last time. Well, fine. I'm just going to do a quick sweep then to make sure we didn't forget anything. Knock yourself out. Is that a bee on her top or a moth? Yeah, I think it might be a B. I do regret my decision last time of not helping her get the bags because that means we left the cabin unexplored and I believe there was probably some good stuff in there which I missed. But it's okay, it's okay. One thing I kind of wish the game did was when it went into like the exploring part that the borders would go. I don't think that is something that you can change. I think that is just what it's like. Unfortunately, we had a look at these last time. Um, so yeah, I just want to check because I don't want to miss anything. Because I also... Oh. Hey! You stop that! <laughs> hmm. In editing the last video, I realized I missed um, a uh, a room back in like the main part of the cabin, which I'm hoping I can explore later. But I just completely missed it. I think with these games, sometimes you don't really know what's gonna send you through to like the next. Thing, which is kind of a bit of a pain. I know um, it's part of the same company, the Dark Pictures Anthology and this, but I I think they're, I'm not too sure on like the differences between who made what, but I think something that they really did well with House of Ashes that they didn't do with um, the previous installments in the anthology, although they might have, I don't, don't like hold me to that was in House of Ashes, if you were going to go into a next room, it would have the X with like the arrows to let you know if you press this button, like you're gonna be going straight through. So make sure you've checked everything. Whereas this game, and also did it with Until Dawn, they didn't let you know. Information signpost. Though this is a novelty signpost, it also acts as a chilling reminder that Hackett's quarry really is a long way from anywhere. I missed something else. See, I wanna go, oh, I feel like that's going back on myself. So I wanna go, where was, I think the X was up here. So I'm gonna go check that. But see, like, I don't know. Cause what if I'm missing something else now? What if there's something else? But what if I go down there and I miss something else? Like, I don't know. I. I'm really scared of missing something now. But I just don't know what's going to take me into the, the next room. Or the next place. Okay, Emma's there. So I'm thinking we might have to speak to Emma. We did say we were going to look around and see if we missed anything. Okay, I'm going to go back because I don't think there's anything else. I'm going to go back and I'm going to check that room, I guess. Oh wait, I missed something here. Something in Emma and someone else. Oh. Wait, I thought Ouch. that was... Ouch. So Jacob hasn't seen this. I swear I missed... Oh, <sighs> empty vial. The truth is out there. Ugh. Ugh, what is that? Is it Dylan's? Ugh. Uh, Jacob plus Emma forever slash summer. Huh, okay. Can I... An empty vial with an unpleasant odor. Interesting, okay. And yeah, I also, I turned the side lights off just to make it a bit darker. 
because I felt like it was fitting. Plus, it was a bit weird, the stark contrast between the game being so dark and obviously me having quite a light room. So I turned that off. Hopefully, it suits a bit more. Oh, we're not going in the cabin. We're going along the side. It's going to be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. Okay, that's an announcement room. I feel like that's necessary. I feel like that's a big deal. Okay. Um, I don't know. I don't really know like where we can go. I don't think there's anything appearing I don't really want to have to walk up all of these just because what well, she's very slow. Oh. Ooh. Dylan is not going to be happy that the kids just left this year. New discovered camp before. I'll tell Chris about it when we see him. Okay, let me have a look at that. Please. Where is it? Here. A recording of the Hackers Quarry camp song from years gone by. Technology may have moved on, but the song remains unchanged. Okay. See, now I'm so worried I've missed other things. I don't think I have. Not in this part, anyway. I don't think, I don't think there'd be anything around here. No, I can't even get around that, okay. Um. Oh, I don't want to proceed because I'm so scared I've like, missed something. I don't know. She takes so long walking upstairs too, like why? Why? Why does it take like a good five seconds for you to walk up a few steps of stairs? I haven't found any tarot cards, which I'm really like worried about. Two, I don't know where they'd be. I think there'd actually probably be one in that room that I missed back in the main cabin. So leaderboard, shooting stars. I don't think anyone knocked Caitlin out of first place all summer. Okay, so some type of shooting no some type of like range and caitlin's good at that okay i think i've got everything i think so <gasps> i didn't re even realize that there was a lake ready to roll oh now i'm i don't know I think I've got everything, but I'm just not sure. Let's do it. Let's do it. I think I got everything. Finally. Fingers crossed, because I have no clue. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? <laughs> I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No, <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Jinkies. Okay. I actually okay, so think that Abigail was drawing Emma. If I were to put myself out there. Maybe. What if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. He's actually really sweet. Ooh. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But why would Go you ahead. not try? That's us. You know, you know Nick could be different. When do you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? 
I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. Oh, hold up! Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Yeah, why not? Yes. Sure, what's the victory? <laughs> Two months, no technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. <laughs> You know what? I actually believe you. I like the friendship Fabby, that they have. Was that a compliment? Your charm is infectious. What can I say? <laughs> I'd subscribe. You better. As soon as you get home, sub, share, <laughs> smash that like button. The holy trinity. Okay, well, now I'm really regretting it. Oh, no. You love me. <laughs> I love Eva because that's what I like with my friends. Not time. like that. I'm not like, Fire oh, pit? you should subscribe, but I'm the island. Very jokey. Not secluded, right? Is is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before you know he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. But speaking of which, we should we should probably. Yeah, get back. Oh, yeah. Worried Nick's, you know, <laughs> gonna leave it at you. Well, no, they're probably, like, all waiting for us. Mm-hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All, everyone, same. <laughs> uh... Hmm... Curious and curious. Okay, it's six o'clock now. Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude. Okay, this place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. <sighs> it's okay. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, ew. <laughs> Hey, Nick. Hey. Jacob and Emma are both wearing green. What would you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Where are your bags? Mr. H locked them in the cabin already. <laughs> Why? To keep out bears? Apparently. Oh, I don't know. Well, why didn't you just break in? Okay, because Dylan thinks that would have been a good idea. That confirms we did the right thing. <laughs> Oof. Ow. I like my ideas. Hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alert. He's literally, somewhere. like, behind I'm you. Here. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast actually oh podcast nice that's cool what's it about hmm why protective yeah what's it about is it about me you think i was listening to a podcast about you okay if anyone here had a podcast about them it'd be me yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. Really so don't look and smell like a butt. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. This episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's it where now? What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Yeah, I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Tongue twister. It's just this 
campfire story for the kids. It's um, there's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. We did there see like a woman in a white whispers gown. or whatever, and, and as Laura figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone. She'll try to turn you into Is Silas son. her son's name? Or kill you. Or something. I don't know. It's never really been clear. Anyways, Haga Haga, it's Corey. You made that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time you told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for life. <laughs> you gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Yeah, uh, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Well, hop to it. Get those butts in gear. Coulda woulda if our bags weren't locked up. What's that? Sounded like you said, of course, Mr. H. We're on it, Mr. We H. We need Sorry, our bags. Mr. Hackett, but our, our bags. Right. Cabin. We're really busting our butts here. Well, except Ryan, who's trying to scare the pants off our butts with his weird ghost stories. Okay, okay, enough with all the butts. Right. And, and what's this about the, ghost the stories? H of H's Q. The hag of Hackett's quarry. I was just... Oh, for Pete's sake, Ryan. Hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. We need our bags. You know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Weird. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Come on, that's like super. I feel unchanged. like he'd be hey, like I'm this. I'm like the chillest flipping bro in the whole world, man. I just need some tunes for the ride, man. <laughs> all right, that's enough. Five minutes? Like, like five minutes, that's all I need, man. He said no, Dylan. Ryan okay, is know, losing his just... patience. Let me meet you at the van, okay? I feel like I'm making all the wrong decisions. I'm scared. What am I? I'm setting myself up for failure. Oh my god. So, uh, Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh oh. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, no. It's, um, it's just, you know, about the whole thing with the. Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> Hello. Okay, can we explore? What? I want to know, okay? I'm nosy. Kids are kids. It'll only be so much, you bro. They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's A-OK -okay on this end. I bet that the sh that's the sheriff. This is a waste of time. You know it, I know it. No, should I have? He's gone quiet. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah, of course. Adios. Okay. Sorry, I, I wasn't... I wasn't listening. I, I was. Chris is disappointed. Waiting. No. I mean, heard, uh, I mean, I was. I oh no. We're cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry, I pushed you out like that. Why am I making all the wrong decisions here? I'm so annoyed with myself. You, uh, you need a hand looking for the keys? Uh, no. End of summer. Busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. 
y you know, it's a, whether or not I should like leave my sister with my grandparents since I'd have to live on campus, you know. My mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, Ryan. Dang it. I don't want to get angry with is him. He's already okay? disappointed with us. You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> Ryan, I told you to make sure everyone was ready. What happened? They don't really listen to me. Then you gotta make them listen, bud. I can't. I mean... Shoot, no time to get their bags now. For real? I don't think the girls are gonna like that. We'll ship them along in a few days. It's, like, so, around the corner. So, <laughs> uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. But do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter, with these terrified kids that they send home? Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp it's kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. Apologetic. Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Gotta understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. It's a big part of being a counselor, a leader. Yeah. Just stick to kumbaya next time, okay? What's that? You guys don't do kumbaya anymore? Good grief. I'm outgrowing my own cliches. Seriously, Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Why? Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. Well, we know that. And we know safety that. is the first step towards fun. Just give me a minute. Where in the good goddamn are they? Oh, is that his Please family? Please say to Caleb and Kaylee for me. They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off-season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? I actually could have used the help packing up since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van... Put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left. Uh -huh. Let's skedaddle. There are definitely some awkward cuts that I'm noticing. I don't really get it. It's like it will make sense and then all of a sudden it will cut and it will end to like a different conversation. But it doesn't really make sense as to what they were talking about previously, and it's very confusing. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. <sighs> yeah, because I'll do all the work. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. Haha. <laughs> you sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good, because it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it, let's go. Hey, what about our bags? Uh, Emma, I'm gonna have to ship them to you tomorrow. Hell no, no, I am not leaving without- It's the way it's gotta be. Come on, Jacob, No, because I would be so mad, that's my stuff. What's the problem? Ugh, dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. 
Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. All right, let me try. What, dude? I'm telling you, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing well, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. The Take fuck? Him. Enough, enough, both of you. Shit, come on, right, come dude, on. Chill, chill, Let's go. dude. <laughs> Everybody back Pop now, updated. now, now! <clears throat> Jacob, wait, 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 wait! I got this. No! Oh my god! Ow, geez, dude, I was trying to help. You don't put water on that type of fire, right? Okay. Okay. Uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. <sighs> okay. Damn it. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. This is hey, Brian. weird. Come here for a sec. Why? You just... What? I don't understand. Make sure that's that everybody his is van. inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. <laughs> Wait. Hear me out for a sec, hear me out. His van was here the night Laura and Max came. What if that was him in the thing? And that's why he's leaving. Is it him? Was it him? <gasps> Pass, a fool's errand. So because we sabotaged the minivan, Jacob's tampering caused the minivan to catch a light. I think, oh my God, wait, I think it was him. Oh my God. Okay, so yeah, I think, I really do think that was him now in the underneath, because the van's his, and it was there. I'll be back first thing in the morning, and we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Compliant. Yeah. I feel pretty bad sure. for this dude. We'll, we'll stay inside. And a boy. Out of boy. Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down. Do we really not have another chance to go get the bags for Emma and Abigail though? So what was that about? He uh said to stay inside that we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Hell. At least you have your phones. Though. Are you kidding me? Don't what have are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside until morning. Yeah. Or. Or we could do something. Y'all are idiots. I. We follow Chris's instructions. No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares what Chris told us to do? Maybe because he's, he's trying to protect us. Anymore. Idiot. I don't like Dylan. This is a Dylan hate club. A-R-T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. No. Oh, dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. Em, what do you say? Mm. The yeah. face animations were a bit the bit Mr. weird. Mr. Hackett pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Why? Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why? Why did he want to scare us? Exactly. Okay, Abigail and Ryan are my favorites right now because they make the most sense. 
he did seem freaked out. I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Nick's Christ. not having it. Chris seemed <laughs> real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. Uh, no, 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 dude, dude. dude. The it's group good, is getting right? bored get of Ryan. No, you, uh, <laughs> you don't want to disappoint daddy. Someone's got to care. Oh, yeah, no, someone's got yeah, to care. Well, someone's got to give a shit. Oh. You know what? <gasps> I don't even care what you guys do. Oh. I'm doing what Chris <laughs> told me. Oh. To do. Ryan, come on, man. Wait. I hate these guys. All right, all right, all right. Hacketeers, party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you go get some firewood. Uh, M and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just I don't know. Figure out how to charge the phones or something. All right, let's do this. I hate them. I hate them so much. Snipe. Why? Why is her a sniper? Okay, so I think... Oh! Excuse me? Why are you covered in blood? Oh my god, is it like the forest situation where they're covering themselves in like a blood or paint or whatever that is? Hunting season, just so they don't get spotted. Mind you, I feel like it would attract them. No? I don't know. I don't know how it works. I'm dumb. Okay. I'm clueless. <gasps> oh, we're back with her. I was hoping you'd come back to I'm wondering me. if we see her after every chapter, then. Let's see what you've found. Literally nothing. No tarot cards. I'm so sorry. You need to look around you, find my cards, I'm and trying. I can help you. Where I'm from, we look out for each other. Find them, please. Okay, we need to try harder. I need to try harder. You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. I'm so stressed out. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. Well, they're your cards. Tell me where you left them. Because I don't know. I have no clue. <clears throat> so annoyed. <laughs> okay, well, that was chapter one. Chapter two. Oh, God. General Storm. Here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide you us. You have like less than half charge. Put prevail, your phone away. Go ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased, like I saw in that one plane. Is he pickpocketing? Oh, pickpocketing. Breaking in. <laughs> First course, filet au Jacob. Rich and full bodied, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Well, what? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. No. Yeah! Oh wait, I thought it was him kicking and the door. Scene. 
I mean, I could have kicked it. You loosened it for me. I feel like this is Mike and Jazz. Okay. Like so, the same, similar vibe. If I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Beep, 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 beep. What beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps That's... me dar for beers. Stop. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna, no. I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Why Mystery would that be slow. beers in a store where kids are buying? I don't understand this logic. Safe. Can we find a code? I think it's locked. Nah. Don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> Makes two of us. Oh. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh! Jackpot! Hey, uh... Check out my giant melons. Oh. So, Ew. You just cut a hole in it? Mm-hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just, you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah. It's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. Or, well, second most. Oh, God. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. Disgusted. Jacob, you should be ashamed of yourself, I swear to God. <laughs> Even she's like, why? Why did I get with him? Of all the people I could have got with, and I got with him, actually an embarrassment. Oh, he's coming, he's following us, God damn it. Okay, there's a door that we can't get into. It is really dark. No, I'm so scared I'm gonna miss stuff. Okay, I think this is another thing to do with the show Can that we saw. Him? Yeah. Oh no! Damaged memorabilia. These flyers. Oh, wait. What is the question? Oh! Yeah, so like, that's. That's what we saw. As Laura, these flies are promoting a traveling show called Harem Scarum. The date listed indicates that it took place over six years ago. Why the question mark? Oh, oh, oh my God, wait. These are the same posts. These are the same as the poster in the woods. Why does Chris Hackett have them? Was he connected to Harem Scarum in some way? Wait, no, I'm not finished. Go back, <laughs> go back. This. Whatever these posters are doing in Chris Hackett's possession, he must have gone to take them down. Okay. Camp store. We're proud to stock a range of treats and snacks for our campers to enjoy during their stay at Hackett's Quarry. Not to mention the ingredients for our healthy meals prepared by our counsellors in the lodge kitchen. And obviously the rest are at the camp. Okay. Interesting. So I thought that would have happened like back in a, a lot longer than six years ago, let's just say that. But that show does seem to be pretty recently. To have happened pretty recently, I should say. Packets Quarry point? Summer Camp. I'd buy it, that's cute. Those are the people we saw before. Okay. What does that mean? What does it mean? <gasps> oh, we can go in here now. God, I can't see. Girlie, get your flashlight out or something. Get your phone out. Can I unlock this? Yeah. 
don't know why we need to unlock that. But hey ho. I think that's just a reflection. I don't think that there's actually anything there. Um, there's nothing there. Look, instead of recording and documenting your stay, maybe use your phone for other important uses, like allowing me to goddamn say. A mask. <laughs> Hello, old friends. Oh, yeah. I don't know. I don't. No, I'm gonna leave it. Maybe I should give the guy a break. Although he does deserve it for how he was acting. Can I change my mind? I wanna change my mind. I wanna scare him. <laughs> oh, I can't. Oh yeah, I can. <laughs> can't pass up an opportunity like this. Okay. Have y'all ever seen a grown man crap his pants? Cause you're about to. Oh my. <laughs> All right, now where should I hide? Do we get to choose? Oh no, maybe. Such a great hiding Jay spot. Emma? Hello? Look, if you're trying to scare me, it's not gonna work. Where did she set the camera angle up? Because I feel like it's in the wrong place. Ah! You not scared of clones? What? No, they're... They're funny. Oh. You think this is supposed to be funny? I mean, yeah. <sighs> Tiny bit. <laughs> wow. Do you think it's funny now, little boy? I, oh, because... You want to join 20 of my sexy clown friends in a tiny car that somehow fits us all like it's... What is she on about? Deal? I... I... He is smitten. What? Moment's gone. <sighs> Not forgotten. I wonder what the whole unlocking that was about. I feel like that might have a big deal. Am I still wearing it? Oh no, take it off. I do feel like it has a bit big of a deal than it's kind of leading out to be. Oh, quote too high, look for cheaper. Lodge renovation plans. Let me see what that's about. Clues. Oh God, I'm missing so much stuff. Blueprints for structural repairs on the lodge chimney column, judging, oh, what we saw as Jacob last episode, judging by the schooled annotations, this is not something that Chris Hackett has the money to action right now. That was with the deer. Yeah. And I did say that the place needed uh, a renovation. Okay, I think that's the door. So let me just check for other things. Hello. Why can't I find no tarot cards? Why are they so difficult to find? What was here? Wasn't this the prop? Yeah, okay. So I think it's just that door. Unless there's something here? No, okay. Just the door. I wonder where this goes. Jacob! Come check this out. Did her voice crack then? Oh, uh, alrighty then. Door. 
buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. We should have just kicked it. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I feel like it was rusty though. That would have been a lot easier to do then. Fucking mother of mine. Good you know golly, me? Miss Molly. I wonder he kept this place locked up. I think he'll be pissed when we made a stash. What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um... <clears throat> human rights, or... Whatever. No! Yeah. All right. Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh. Can Hell we not yeah. just open it from the inside? In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. <gasps> tarot card. Please be a tarot card. Please. <sighs> Nothing there. Come on, give me a tarot card. Give me something good. Jacob, check this out. No. I can't move. Yeah. Else the door latch. They look like camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. Torn bag. <laughs> Interesting. Let me have a look. Torn hiking bags dashed with flecks of dried blood. Okay. Oh, cool. That's a shotgun. What? what is it? A gun. Oh, cool. Shotgun with a flashlight. And, uh, for the safe. 7739. Okay. Safe code. We got it. And we know that there's a gun. If she doesn't take okay. it, we know there's a gun in here. Okay. Oh, she is taking it. Okay, cool. That's good. But once they arm themselves. Uh, that's just the bags. Okay, let's go. I think I got everything. Let's go to the safe. Oh. So you're, uh, you're really gonna keep the gun? Why, well, yes, I am. Yeah. For bears. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, I am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. And I'm gonna go to the safe. Okay. I'm hope I'm not missing anything in here. I did check it all. Um, I think I've got everything. I'm just gonna go back this way just in case I did miss something. Cause I'm an idiot. It doesn't look like I have though, so I think I'm in the all clear. For this place at least. All right. Didn't even need to remember the code. God damn it. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> Shotgun shells. What else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. Oh, oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should- That's gonna, gonna draw Emma? attention to ourselves, no! Fireworks. No! But it could be a good SOS signal. You know, you're right. <laughs> fireworks. <laughs> I'm just winging yeah, this. Oh yeah, fireworks. Oh, um, and might I just add, um, fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob seems excited. Hey, it's like the I one these, good like, emotion I've had from someone. Bags back there. They were pretty messed up and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. He doesn't care. Stay right there. You will care, Jacob. You will. <sighs> oh, dude. Peanut butter butter pops. Are those dude, like Reese's peanut butter puffs? Fucking butter pops. Oh, affectionate. What are Butter pops. No. What? I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um <clears throat> Are they a real thing? Pop pop peanut butter butter pops. <laughs> pop 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 them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my god. They're like the greatest snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. 
they're like their own thing, like their own subgenre of food okay. snack. Okay. You know what? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. You sure I mean, about that? Like Twenty years older. Okay. okay. Look, they predate expiration dates. What? Well, you're gonna love them. <laughs> well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure or buds. Like Emma's? <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh... It's like, um, does it's like she, a barrel with wheels. Does she not know what one is? Put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. <sighs> does she first. not know what a wheelbarrow <laughs> is? Which way? You forgot the watermelons. All of that, and you bloody left them. Idiot. Idiot. How could you leave the watermelons? Rude, actually. Quite rude. <laughs> Hackett's All Quarry, right. Dylan. The inner sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. Oh, we're back in the office. <laughs> yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure, just give me a sec to get this going. And engage. Oh, they're charging their phones, okay. Podcasts. Yeah. All right. Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, Bizarre Yet Bonafide. So, like, ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like, the, the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're, well, bonafide. Boner, fine. Get it? Boner. <laughs> Your wit knows no bounds. So, should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. I what do not like this guy. A summer camp full of impressionable young children gonna have anyway. <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know. He's cool. It's always been cool to me. Oh, and I have to as well. God damn it. I don't like well, doing this. this thing. Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. Why? My phone's charging. Oh my god, shall I flirt? <laughs> I don't want to be sarcastic. Uh, so that I can ask you out on a date, duh. Mmm, smooth. Ryan seems interested. Hello? What? What? Who is it? Oh my god. Uh, hello? It's weird, I thought I heard someone. Huh. Maybe you should have asked them out on a date. <laughs> Damn it, I missed my shot. <laughs> it's cute. Family photo. Kaylee and Caleb Hackett. So I think kids, they huh? attend the camp I like too. Them. Because yeah, Ryan yeah, me knows too. them. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Weird. Interesting family photo. A younger looking camp leader, Chris Hackett, with his two kids, Caleb and Kaylee. They look happy. In the past, playing with fire, going out with a bang, loud bangs, heart-stopping cracks, and kaleidoscopic hues. When the world rains color and light, it might frighten those who hide in the dark. Oh, I feel like this was a good idea. Emma chose to take the fireworks with her. Okay, I feel like for once I made a good decision and took it. Okay, there's that. Let me just check over here. Hey, what's the gun for? <gasps> okay, there's another uh, shotgun. Chris. Mr. H told me it was. Well, there's shotguns with animals. Bears. Bears. So like a here. hunting rifle would be better. Yeah, yeah. He Who's said the they name? don't really come around. Hunting. He's got the gun. To... 
Yeah. <laughs> no, I think Leave that is alone. a shotgun. Leave it alone. What if we need it? Dude, what if we're out partying tonight out in the woods and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation? Like when people hunt other people? Yeah. Yeah. What? I mean, think about it. It's camp is over and hunting season has just begun. True. What if, what if okay, bear with me here. What if Bye. what's on the menu tonight is us? Well, then I guess we would need to protect ourselves. Exactly. That's why we need the gun mm. for protection. Yeah, not going to happen. What about for fun? No? Okay. Yep. Yeah, yeah, Just totally. leave her. We already have one. I'm a husband, so it's fine. Well, we know where the gun is if we need it. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you. Your call, man. Thank you. I don't think there's anything else. Oh, wait. There's there's a door and there's the, the, the trap door. But there's also you. But I feel like if I speak to you... Oh, Lord. I don't know. Okay. Let's check here. I'm- I'm so nervous I'm gonna miss stuff. Well, hello, what is this? You hear that? Is that a trap door? <laughs> I knew that there was a secret sex dungeon around here somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet you Mr. H is into some real kinky shit. Uh, I doubt it. Weren't there a couple of counselors who never showed up? Laura uh -huh. and Max. Why? Secret sex dungeon. Yeah, I think they're still funny. down there. Just go to the basement or something. <laughs> Open it up. No, 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 you're you idiot. All right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness, so. You're being dramatic. Climb down, take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it, you climb down. I want to climb down. I'm sorry. I want to know. We chose a path. I I have. I want to know. I'm. I. I just. I'm. Mind you, I should have probably checked the other places first. What's down know. there? Oh my God, Ryan! You will what? not believe this. What? 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 It's nothing. Oh. Hey. I that had does... to go in there for a second, didn't I? No. Not looked like nothing. Maybe. Just shut up. That looks scary. It is uh, pretty spooky down here, though, and it smells very unnatural, so... Yeah, okay, I'm coming back up. <laughs> Path updated. Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. You better hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> Ring Do I sense oh, some tension? Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that your impression darn of Darn tootin' doozy of a day. Uh, yeah, uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I, you're absolutely right. He does need to be nicer to Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Smooth. <laughs> Check the door. Oh, Laura Kearney and Max Brindley. Oh yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. Clue discovered. Okay. Have a little check. Clues. A list of the counselors' names, personal details, and their task at camp. Two names are crossed out. Lorna Kearney and Max Brindley. Why didn't they show up? Crossed out because they're dead. 
Watch your step. Find your footing or lose your life. When each step is taken a step towards the sunrise, it can be treacherous to follow in someone else's footsteps rather than carve your own path. Dylan opened the trapdoor in Chris's office. Dis Dylan loosened a rung on the ladder. Oh Lord, no, that's bad. Okay, now I there's this option or there's this option and I don't know what one's the right one to do. I'm gonna choose this one instead. <laughs> Can't you like speed it up at all? I can try to encourage them. Go for it, you guys can do it. It's not working. <laughs> we're gonna have to wait. <laughs> I don't know who, I don't know what to do. Do I go to the door? Do I go to him? I don't know. I don't know what one. I don't know what one's gonna send me off. So, got I don't know. When you get back home, school or uh, jury's out. Understood. Girlfriend? Uh, not exactly. Boyfriend? Free agent. Cool. Yeah. Me too. So we know Caitlin likes him, but now we know Dylan the, uh, also likes him too. Phones. Uh, they could probably use a little while longer. Ah, oh. okay. Cuties. Okay, I I kind of like them together. Okay, I'll check it now. Oh, it's locked. God damn it. Okay. Yo, my guy, pass me the keys. Oh. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area. I, I'm sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? Hardy har har. <laughs> Come on. Hardy har har. har. You're not a little bit curious? I'm not going to touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but... <laughs> Nothing but net. <laughs> now I know it's still cycle. It's a lot easier. Oh. Please be a tarot card. Please be a tarot card. Give me the tarot card. Huh. Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. Wow, there's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... Uh, Brian? Wait, there was more stuff I Whoa, wanted to what check. The fuck? These monitors, this is the camp. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, no, no, he can't be. I they're mean, just, <laughs> they're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. Something wants to go wrong. Most it's of the good. cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids. Unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just probably just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People set them up to catch weird. Or if something shit. happens. Okay, yeah, like what? Oh my god, like, what are they thinking? Why should they? Sightings, you know, that kind of thing. I didn't know that Mr. H was into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Expensive hobby. Yeah, well, I mean, what else are you going to do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret that door a in sauce. the closet? Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by stuff. I feel like they yeah, share the same definition. Is, Brian. It, it's weird. It's major league yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but it, it's it's got to be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure, that won't be an awkward conversation, like at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. All right. I I'm leaving the secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. I don't kind of like how the companions don't stay with you does that make sense like they they just go off and stand somewhere 
maps. Okay. Oh, wait, well. Letters. Huh. Max. <gasps> Okay. Was the sorry, this camera angle's a bit weird. Cameras. This mic. Maybe he has his own podcast. Maybe the podcast is created by him. <laughs> oh god, is there gonna be a jump scare? Why is camera A out? That. That's the guy. He's turning the cameras out. It's probably nothing. Probably nothing. <laughs> Internal crying. It says to investigate the secret back room, but I have done that. I did, there are only three things, and I have looked at all of them. Unless, should we look again? I don't know if there'll be anything different. Okay, no, I don't think there's anything different. Okay, these are boring. <laughs> Maybe if you waited long enough, something else would have popped up, but I, I don't think so. I think that is all there is kind of left to do. Can't get out the door. Get out. Thirty two twenty eight. Okay, but there's this. <gasps> a guitar. Play it. Play it. Strum a tune. Strum a few chords. A minor. C. E. E. E minor. Give me a tarot card. I'm looking. Okay. I'm actually trying. Nothing. I really thought there would have been a tarot card in there. It does still say to investigate. Oh, check the charging cell phones. Okay, well, I, I investigated it as much as I could. I'm really surprised there's not a tarot card in there. I, I thought that would have been. Should I speak to him again? So if you do go to school in the fall, have you like picked out a major or I don't know man it's kind of hard to talk about right now oh have you not decided what you're gonna do with your life hey are the phones done yet <laughs> he's getting mad he's not getting mad he's just playing nice nice full up. that is not full okay I think I've explored hey, everything so let's right, head cool, to the party go. Thank you. I do kind of wish it was more open world in a sense, so like I could go back and look at the rooms that I haven't, that I missed, but I, unfortunately it's not. Okay, 705 Hackett Woods, we're playing as Nick. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Oh, yeah, she yeah, likes him. Watches, huh? Yeah. <laughs> They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. <laughs> yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. The height difference. Oh my god. Which way should we go? Rocky Road. Why don't you choose? Oh. Shady Glade. Shady Glade is calling me. So, <laughs> so I've got to go Shady Glade. Let's go this way. <laughs> oh. oh. Oh my god, are you okay? I'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I'll spot you. Is it a quick time? Oh no. Oh, okay. That was a bit weird. I don't know why. Okay. 
Uh, oh, sorry. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, there are so many ways to go. I want the tarot. How am I meant to find anything in this? <gasps> Found something. I like the songs. Is that a camera? Yeah. Maybe it's for the wildlife? Okay. Yeah. Trail cam. Makes sense. Clue discovered. Trail camera. A trail camera hidden in the trees, a security measure perhaps, or maybe they're tracking something. Trail cameras around the camp are controlled by Chris Hackett from a secret room in his office. It's like he's looking for something. Yeah, so I figured that that would have been connected to the cameras that we found as Dylan. Let's face it, there's probably going to be a tarot card out here and I'm just going to completely miss it because it's such a huge area and we can just like go everywhere. Maybe if we just walk up and down. Oh, my nose. see anything so I'm hoping I'm not missing anything well let's face it I probably am oh oh wait there's a trunk a chest I don't know what it's called <laughs> ranger box oh like a supply cache for rangers or whatever if they're out in the woods like a supply cache for rangers or whatever if they're out in the woods oh. <laughs> naked rangers <laughs> so it would seem <laughs> werewolves i i still think it is something to do with werewolves uh sorry where was that under where was it was it here, oh. A box in the woods unlocked inside is a change of clothes, bottled water and supplies. Provisions for a ranger, perhaps? Do these woods even have a ranger? Okay. Then we're at Shady Glade. Shady Glade, one of many woodlands walked through Hackett's quarry, is so named due to the canopy of tall trees that grow there. The dirt path through the floral undergrowth makes for a serene atmospheric walk through the nature. How lovely. God damn it, where are these tarot cards? Oh, wait, what? So, um, I heard this joke about artists. I swear I was going the other way. I'm yeah. so confused. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You want to hear it? Sure. Okay. Here it is. Why couldn't the world's fastest painter ever keep a girlfriend? Hmm, why not? because he always finished in one stroke. It's dumb. Sorry, Jacob told me about it. Uh, isn't that about golfers? Because of the stroke thing? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I don't know. He's trying to impress her and it's heard so it from his cute, campers. but no. <laughs> that makes so much sense. Those kids have filthy minds. <laughs> Whoa, just a bird. Just a bird. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. I've just been on a little, just been a little edgy lately. Why? Why? It's probably nothing, but ever since the campers left, I've had this weird feeling that there's someone else out there, like watching us. Well, there are cameras. So there are still campers here? No. No, it's you know, just the little hairs in the back of my neck standing up, you know? Yeah. Well, 
It's probably nothing. I hate that. I hate that. You're right. Give me the validation. Like, just say, well, we'll, 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 we'll see. I'd be like, oh, it's probably nothing. Right. I think we're back near the path again. I know where we are. Yeah? Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. Wow. This view is just... Ooh. Do me. Oh, well, sorry. I'm, I'm just trying to. Oh, get no. <laughs> right. Abigail sorry. is trying to no concentrate. Idea. I just want to finish this. Take your time. That's so embarrassing. I wanted to have a cute moment there. Damn, the sunset she's taking so long. Did you hear that? Huh? I forgot this was a it's horror game up. for a minute. No, listen. I did. There's something there. Is that a pig? Look. It's so tiny. Oh my god, he's so cute. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> oh no. You're oh Lord have mercy on my poor soul. Lord no. Indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting? I just wanted to save Abigail. Dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. Okay, is this a keep the controller still when or the, the... past? Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature. No! Actually, serious consequences. Stop. Stop. Do not do this. No. I don't know when it's safe. Oh, God. This is so much worse. <laughs> oh, this slime. Oh. I thought it'd gone. Okay, did you get all that? Huh? I thought you were gonna draw me getting French by a wild pig. Ah, oh, got it all up here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna get people killed because of that. I know, I know that for sure. There's no escape. So it does remind me a lot of True Colors, Life is Strange. Guess we should head back. The little sway of their hips. I don't know, it's really cute. I still haven't found a tarot card though, and I'm stressed because I do not know where they are. 
Why are they so hard to come by? Okay, this is Caitlyn. 722. <sighs> Finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. Well, you're still in the middle of the woods, so... <laughs> Do not know why you'd expect any different. Beautiful. Dylan, where's Ryan? Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. No right? To okay, Kaylin gets it. You guys it. have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? I, I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Brian. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. <laughs> I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Please stop. Are you done? You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do. Sometimes. But... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick. Just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. I but really thought I was a pig. Oh my god. For the team. Uh, are you sure you guys are okay? Nobody got gored? We're okay. Fine about it. wasn't a bullfight or anything. Though I think Nick did make a new girlfriend. Oh, do tell. Oh. Whoa. Special delivery. Oh, he did pick up whoa, the whoa, watermelons. Whoa. Where the hell did that gun come uh, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh. Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine, fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. No. Guns are no joke, dipshit. Okay, and yeah, I agree, but like, it is if we haven't. We you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, oh, freaking Lord. way. No. Pop, no. Pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these... I've spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on, Emma. <laughs> Please hand me the shotgun. What, you're going to shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Schedule loose. I'm not letting Jacob the gun there. There is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, no. look, you and me, old fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Just Dude, share them. I guess you don't really want them then, huh? These guys give me a headache. <laughs> fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, no. so we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Yeah. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old fashioned <gasps> shootout. Hey, ho! Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh, we'll be good. Oh lord. <laughs> he didn't even hit you that hard.
other girls just like, um, why? Why am I attracted to this guy? Okay, so just so you know, I was an expert marksman, third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you'd actually... Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm Shut hot. up! Yeah, okay, thank you. Bye. Bye. No, you're not shooting the good old watermelons. So, how's your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? It was... It was okay. Hey! boy. So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's... Really smart. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 hey, look, no sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Stop it. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please, just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Okay, aye, so aye. I think I'm actually playing right. some Nick. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obvs. Okay. Oh, the haptic feedback. All right, Nick, one point. I didn't think it would have haptic feedback okay, for some reason. Okay, we're too far reason. back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay. All right, Nick, this time for real. Okay. Nice shot. Am I doing the bottle too? Lucky. It's a shotgun, babes. You don't need that much accuracy, I'm not gonna lie. I say. It's like, try my best to line it up. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. See what you got. All right, you might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right, just shut up and shoot, Jacob. Oh, I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle, Whoa, okay, dude, not with this freaking cannon dude, blaster. That is how you get someone shot. Nah, it's okay, you probably would have missed me anyway. <laughs> hey! Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No! That's your own fault. Sorry, Jacob. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time? Hey, I Butter. say it, but you're both very mean. <laughs> this was your idea. It's not my fault you've lost. <gasps> Blam. We thought this was over? What the? Whoa. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. All those wasted shotgun shells. All those wasted shotgun shells. We'll need them in the future. We're gonna need them. And you, you wasted them, you idiots. Swear to God. Okay, we're playing as Ryan, the campfire pair is eight. I feel like it's lighter than this in August at eight o'clock.
Okay. New idea. Party game. Uh, Come on, people. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Oh, oh what God. do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So like cool. normal truth or dare? Yes. So we can like make people kiss? If they choose <gasps> dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents. I have plans here. Sorry, my headphones are really messy on my hair. I mean, keep it in your pants <laughs> until it's your turn, but. Well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, so. Abigail. Truth or dare? Um. Truth. You really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I, uh, The thing is, I... you could just lie. Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on. I, I'm not You finished. could just lie. You don't actually have to tell the truth. Who's gonna know? Have Dylan is annoyed by my interruption. At this camp. <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, uh, Abby, oh my yeah. god, just pick someone. Okay, okay. Um, this game is so stressful. Uh, I don't know. Ugh. Ding, ding, ding. Too late. My turn. Ryan. Truth or dare? Oh my god, I get to pick. Give me what you got. Dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare comes with a choice. Can't you do that? I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you to kiss either Caitlin or Dylan. Oh! I mean, I guess both. I have to choose. Sorry. I don't make the rules. I mean, you literally <laughs> just did, but okay. Let's do this. Oh, I prefer Caitlyn to Dylan, but I just, I see more chemistry between Dylan and him. So I'm gonna go Dylan. Dylan, let's go. I'm sorry, Caitlyn, I'm so sorry. Cause I know Caitlyn likes him, but. I just, I feel like Always have it, there are please. people connected. I just have more time with them spent together. I haven't seen Caitlyn and Ryan really interact by themselves, so. Alrighty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Jacob, I'm gonna get him with Emma. All right, I'm Jacob, setting them up. Let's see what you're made of. Oh, there, there, man, come on. Okay. I dare you oh. to take a flying leap over that fire pit. <laughs> Naked. Oh, dude! Fuck yes! Oh, Please I don't. will jump over this thing. I don't care. Oh, God. Cover your yeah, eyes, children. Cover your idea. eyes. Oh, Lord. No, no, Jacob. Wait. Don't do it. <laughs> Stop. Dude, I say veto. You're gonna fuck yourself up. <laughs> what? Oh, no, come on, man. Lord. I got this. I, come on. Fine, Vito. You know what? Fuck this game. All right. <clears throat> Someone else can go. Okay, fine. Then I call your turn. <clears throat> Whatever. Emma. There. Emma, so you have to kiss... Jacob. Jacob? Or... Oh. Nick. Uh. Don't do Nick. No, don't. Well then. Um. Uh, sorry, Nick. No, don't do it. No, 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 no. I don't know if that's a good idea. No, I choose Nick. Oh no, no, 
No. No, that's your friend. You No. Um, seriously? No, stop. Oh no. Guys. Oh, can you guys stop? Guys! Thank you, Nick. He's good. That, you knew! Why would you do that? You're like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? Oh it was no! I am nobody's girlfriend. The oh no! Was. Stop! It was just a game. Stop! Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob, grow up. No, that was so wrong. I'm pretty well, sure Emma knew I'd be like Nick. Go after him. You should probably go find Abby. Why would you do that? That was so Ooh. unnecessary. Anybody want to play Parcheesi? What? That was just uncalled for. They're looking. Fuck this. Okay, I think that was the end of chapter. Welcome back. One. I am as always. No, just delighted two. that you're here. Hey, I, I have no tarot cards. I'm sorry, okay? So, I'm useless. Then, what more has been found? You return without any more of my cards. Yet you return nonetheless. What I is don't that, know do where they are. I'm looking. I can't help you without the cards. I want them found. I want them returned to me. But I don't. Please, where am I supposed to look? Where? I have no That's clue where they I are. That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain buried and... No, like, I'm mad. I genuinely don't know Once where to find again, them. You can count on that. Be careful. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Why? I d where are they? Where am I not looking? Because I don't know. The only two places that I didn't... Wasn't able to, like, thoroughly, properly check was... The woods with Nick and Abigail, or um, Abigail at the beginning. No, that was chapter one. Okay, Abigail's in the woods. What are we in middle school? Why should I even care? Anybody can kiss anybody. Stupid. Stupid. Great. Where the hell am I? Is this another bath situation? Okay. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna leave that there for today. Let's have a little look. So that was Rocky Road. So Abigail's actually in Rocky Road right now. So I'm pretty sure if you went to Shady Glade, or no, Rocky Road with Nick first, you probably would have gone to Shady Glade, but I don't know. Scouting the edges of Shady Glade, Rocky Road is a scenic ramble along the forest's rock faces. A beautiful demonstration of the power of nature and one of the many wonderful secrets that lies in the woods of Hackett's Quarry Camp. Then there's the fire pit. Relax and unwind with a sing-along where the fire pit, situated right on the picturesque lakeside, is a perfect place to catch up with your bunker mates, bunk mates after a hard day of hacketeering. Shady Glade, Abigail's in. We don't know where Emma is, we don't know where Jacob is, and we don't know where Nick is either. Okay, let's look at the pass. Playing with fire. Emma set up fireworks while rejoining the others at the fire pit. See, I feel like that they need to, they need that to like frighten whatever it is. I can't believe I've missed even more tarot cards. Though. I have no clue where to look. Like I'm trying, but I just genuinely don't know. I thought I was Thara too. I thought I was Thara, but apparently not. But yeah, we are now on chapter. Th I'm gonna try and do it chapters at a time. I think this part is gonna be a bit longer just because I obviously had to finish chapter one then do chapter two. But again, I am really enjoying it. <laughs> These guys are kind of annoying me just with like their choices, but then I'm also making the choices. So I don't know. I have no clue where this is going. I am kind of getting like the forest cannibal type vibe feel from the two guys, but I still pretty am certain that it's worth wolves, especially since 
We found the trunk with the outfits, the provisions. We also found, well, we figured out that Mr. What was his name? What is his name? Is his name Hackett? I don't know. But we, we know that the, 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 the main guy, that was his van. And then I think he was underneath. And there's also like the stairs leading down. Although I made the wrong choice there too. I don't know. I'm very anxious. I'm very scared as to what I've... <laughs> the future of these guys upon. But I have no clue where these tarot cards are. I'm struggling to find them. I don't know. But I'm gonna leave that there for today. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and hopefully I'll see you in the next part of the quarry. Okay, bye.